Hello everyone, in this video I'll be talking about multi-link keyboard. <clears throat> this keyboard supports multiple languages within one keyboard so you don't have to install different IMEs for different languages. Let's take a look. This is how the keyboard looks like. They are different things you can do. Let's go to keyboard settings and inside here you can see that the settings are similar to the stock Android keyboard with a few more additions. Let's talk about the input languages first. Now the way the keyboard works is that you have to enable the language that you wish to input and also download the dictionary so that you have uh, <clears throat> you have word correction for it for the language scroll down we can see English is included what's interesting is that um, there are a number of Asian languages available let's say we have the Korean keyboard and we have the Mandarin keyboard and the Japanese keyboard as well so this makes it easier at least for me to input different languages without tap and holding the input field just to change language input language coming down here we have various settings here we have the keyboard team we can choose the basic and this should give us the froyo keyboard and here let's take a stone stone is like that Cross we have gingerbread. Now we have the option to make the keys wider. Let's say if I untick this, how it look like? It will look like this. I've also enlarged the key font size. If it's normal, it should look like normal, small. The rest is pretty much normal. Take a look at this. Now you would have seen me playing with these settings just now. So this here is the cursor mover. Let's type something here first. So this one will bring me like so. This will be the number pad. This would toggle between different keyboard sizes. This will bring me to settings. This will pull the keyboard down. This would be the emoticon. 
we have a star here this would be other symbols uh, smiley which we have to download separately accents Writing and then of course if you want to change languages you slide your finger across the space bar of course you can hold down and move up and down like so So that's it for the video, thanks for watching.